Hello everyone. Welcome back to service now 911. So as you see on the screen, we are discussing Glide Record versus Glide Record Secure. So for demonstration, I have created an scoped application known as Test Glide Secure. And in that application, I have this table available. And in general, I have created a UI action on incident form that is test secure okay so that ui action actually copying the records name of this table into the incident description so right now i am in global application this is the table i was talking about test glide secure so it is having two records test record one and test record two this is the field name and this is my incident form and here you see test secure okay this is the ui action and then you see this UI action here. It is on incident form and just look at the script. I have created the same script for glide record secure and glide record. OK, so first of all, we will test it with glide record. So just remove the comments here. You see here it is a glide record which is capturing one of the record from this table and just updating the description and then updating it okay of incident form save it so as i am admin it will not impact me let me go to some non admin user and for that i have used able tutor which is of itil role okay so if i impersonate able tutor let me reload this incident form just look at the description it is nothing it is null let me click on the button let me open this incident you see here the description is updated from one of the value of this table that is in different application scope right now let me go back and impersonation come back here let me comment this one okay and then active the glide record secure the script is same only the difference is glide record secure so using glide record we are able to update that particular incident now if i save this let me change the value to something else let me remove the value okay and save this now just impersonate again to the itl user that is able tutor now let me click on test secure open this incident say my 19 one right you see nothing happened there is no update here in the description why it is happening it is happening because we are using glide record secure just focus what is the difference it is checking whether the user is eligible to update the script or not the ACLs are pre-enforced before the script run. But in the case of Glide Record, everything is the same. Only the enforcement of ACL is not done. You have to do it explicitly by yourself. Glide Record Secure is checking whether the thing which you are going to update, are you allowed to update it? Are you allowed to access it? It will take care of all the necessary access control limitations.